Good lovely day. Everybody, welcome back to my channel. myself in the mirror this morning but we have a very interesting fun day ahead of us dada i swear the first thing that she said this morning when she woke up was daddy <laughs> And she's just been so sweet. Anyway, we have a five and a half long drive to Jacksonville, Florida today. We are going to Jacksonville for Marissa's birthday. It's actually today. I need to text her happy birthday. Beckham just ate some eggs and some toast and who knows what we'll be eating for breakfast if we even get breakfast because I just feel like today is going to be a little bit chaotic. I last night had to check my attitude because I was already like, oh my gosh, I feel so defeated and like it hadn't even started yet. So I had to check myself and be like, you know what? No, today's gonna be a great day. And even though it's not exactly what we're used to every day, it can still be great and amazing. Ooh. We have to finish packing. We are pretty much packed. We just have to actually put our stuff in a bag. Beckham, I just kind of have to run around and grab some of her stuff. I did most of the stuff that I could last night regarding like food and stuff like that. I'll show you guys what I've done. I pre-packed some formula and then I set out some of her treats. Set out some avocados because we're gonna bring them. And then, and I cooked some pasta down here and I made her a little snack bowl for her in the car. You can't really see because of the water, but it is puffs, some beef, some bananas, some raspberries, and some avocado pasta. So yeehaw, she'll have that for the car. And then I went ahead and cleaned off all her raspberries and I got some overnight oats and then some yogurt for the car if she wants it. And then we're bringing the bread that we use here for her to have. And then we will just put it all in this little freezer bag. Now this is all the stuff I want to put in a bag because I really don't know what I want to wear. So one of these we just have to do. And then I have some other stuff in the other room. All right, I'm all packed. Now we just have to fit it all into here. I actually have a lot more space in here than I thought. So maybe we should fit some more stuff. All right, all done. I'm grabbing the last few things in the house because Darian just packed the car. It's random things that I forgot, clearly. We're only 30 minutes past the time that we wanted to leave, which honestly is a lot better than we normally would be. It's 1025 currently. We wanted to leave at 10. We do still need to stop for breakfast, so I count that. All packed up. We couldn't fit some stuff we wanted to bring, but that's okay. I might as well just start this trip on a backseat journey, because I will be here for most of the car ride to keep her entertained, feed her, give her a bottle, you know, the whole nine. She's already trying to get out. She took a little nap and ate like the tiniest bit, but I'm interested to see how this goes for sure. I have, you know, high hopes. She's an amazing baby. It's just hard to keep her entertained while she's like sitting down the whole time. Also, I need to brush my hair. Like, what are we doing? I already kind of want lunch. I'm in the mood for Chick-fil-A and lately when I've been in the mood for something, I like have to have it. The other day I was craving bagels like crazy and I ended up going somewhere else to eat and I still went and got the bagels I was craving because I just had it on my mind. guest bathroom right now. It's been a little chaotic the last hour. We had to go to Best Buy and pick up her camera because we left it. And then we got here and Beckham was not a fan of the dogs. So we had to, you know, work through that a little bit. Everybody's already ready. So I'm going to get ready really quickly and then make my way downstairs, see all the decor, hug the B-Day girl, you know. Luckily, the party is at her house, so we don't have to go anywhere. That would have been chaos. this way. I'm begging you to stay. And if I could show you, I'd hope that you could see all the possibilities. There could be a place for you and me. And under the stars, you pack up your car. Good morning, guys. Last night was so 
fun and so sweet. I couldn't show it with sound because they had a band there that was playing music and so it got copyrighted if you don't know about that. But it was so sweet getting to celebrate Marissa and everything was so cute. She had these candles that were made out of butter and as they burned, the melted butter would go and you could like dip your bread in it. Anyway, there were just like so many little, little details that were so special and cute. But today is the game. So we need to get ready. I am so stressed about what I'm gonna wear because I realized last night that I left my only outfit that I actually wanted to wear on my floor. I don't know how. And Bridget is up downstairs, so let's go see. And Beckham sounds like I want to see her. Well, now that I just walked out, I don't think I can hear anybody down there. I need to make myself a coffee. Stat. I was wondering about you. This is the eating situation we have going on. We had to take her to the dining room because she doesn't like the dogs. I have to make myself a little coffee. Definitely double. I'm doing some maple syrup with cinnamon. This is so weird because I never do this anywhere other than here. I gotta mix that a little more and then I'm gonna put the in the espresso. This is the superior oat milk. Mixy, mixy. I poured four shots of espresso, which is a little much, but I need it. How I'm gonna revive this is gonna be truly a miracle because my hair just is having a moment. Now we add ice. Perfect. Time to get ready. Two different clips in my hair. Ignore it. I can't wait to show you guys my outfit because I know it's gonna get mixed reviews. <laughs> you know it will. The weather today is not ideal, but you know what? We're gonna make it work. I don't know what is up with the, the Lawrence Hotel, but when I make coffee here, it's the best coffee I've ever made. Like, I can't make coffee like this at home. Okay. We need to hurry because we have so much that we need to do for Beckham before we go. I think Darian's out there packing for lunch. I'm trying to get in the car in the next, like, 15 minutes. So what are we going to do with my hair? Because she is struggling. I'm scared this is going to make me look like Cindy Lou Who. I just did my hair in literally two seconds because we're a little rushed for time. I don't think it looks, like, horrible. I've never done, like, a Dyson before, and that's what I did. But let's just do our final touches. I'm so excited to be with everyone today because I have not been to a Jaguars game. And in like a year. Well, I was pregnant last year and I couldn't travel. So it'll be fun to be back and to bring Beckham for her first game. It's gonna be so sweet. Let's go get dressed. All right, y'all, here is the fit. I know we're gonna get some mixed reviews, okay? One of the only things I brought because, like I said, I love my other one at home, so we're gonna make her work. Time to go. Hello guys, we are back home. Beckham did so good traveling back home. I am very happy to just be back into our normal schedule. Thank you guys so much for watching. Subscribe if you have not. We just hit 32,000, which is crazy. And I'm so grateful. This week, I'm going to be filming Friendsgiving. I'm going to be filming our weekend vlog. We might be traveling this weekend, haven't decided. Either way, I'll see you next Thursday with another vlog. Goodbye.